Yo, what up, what up? It's your boy Shady C here. Just finished my, uh, my Michael Jackson video. Now I want to talk about an issue that's pressing on my heart. Um, I made a video a long time ago called Palm Tran Problems Episode 1. I never made another one. Now we're going to start doing more of these because Palm Tran ain't fixed yet. So my biggest problem right now with Palm Tran is they pay no attention to danger. Let me give you an example. These buses are always late, but that's not what this video is about. Um, if you own a business, there is a thing in the business world called capacity. Now, if you, if your capacity, if the people you can, if it's 500, and you have 501, and a cop finds out, you can get shut down. Your business can be closed. You've done, or at least, at least you get a fine or something. If you're one person over capacity. Palm Chan, on the other hand, these drivers, first off, normally they don't speak a lick of English. And uh, what was funny is I called to complain. Um, I called the Palm Tran hotline. And I'm like, yo, first off, your drivers don't speak English. And she said, why be racist? I said, speaking English, not speaking English is not a race. She's like, well, you, you're talking about Hispanics. I said, no, you have a driver that's German. I can't stand him. He's white. He's whiter than white. He's whiter than me. Whiter than Michael Jackson. But, um, no. Um, he doesn't speak hardly a word of English. I don't like it. But, I mean, there's also people who are, um, there's drivers who are Haitian. There's drivers who are Italian. It, it, to me, it's not a racial issue. It's an issue of, I want to understand you. Especially if you're in the business world. If you're working, and I am, um, patronizing your establishment. I want to be able to, to understand you and have you understand me. So, last time I was on the bus, the bus was literally, picture this, every seat was full, and there's a little standing area. That was full. There's a little yellow line separating the driver from the passengers. And the driver says, get the behind yellow line. And I said, um, I can't. Literally, there was not a place to move. There is no personal body space. People were rubbing up against people's booties and stuff, and not even purposely, just because you had to. There was literally no breathing room. You were smelling the other person's hot, stinky breath. And um, so I called Palm Tran. And I said, uh, yeah. Um, and I was nice at first. I said, uh, your drivers aren't aware of capacity. They, they, that word doesn't, doesn't um, enter their brain. And she said, what do you mean? And I said, uh, <coughs> Lord. And I said, uh, well, the sitting area and the standing area normally are both completely full. There's no personal space you have you're just crammed up against everyone it's like a new york subway oh uh, well they have to keep picking people up what but there's no room where are they gonna put them on the roof they want people hanging out the door i said if this bus were to crash and because all these people were standing there like if there's an injury or a death due to that palm train would get sued which is what i think needs to happen i don't wish death or harm on anyone but palm train ain't gonna fix that until it gets sued i guarantee it they get sued shit will change and with the one especially, the one bus, Monday through Friday, the one bus is supposed to come around every 25 minutes. It, it usually is later than that because they don't know how to be on time. But it's supposed to come around every 25 minutes. I can wait an extra 25 minutes. I've done it before. I've got stood on the bus, looked at all the people, seen that it was packed, and said, yeah, um, I'm going to wait for the next one. Thank you. And I've seen people get off the bus early at a stop that we weren't even supposed to get off at. Oh, I, I'm going to catch the next one. I can't do this. Palm Tran is literally one of the worst companies in Florida. I was talking to one of the heads of the RPM thing where they were trying to say everything was going to be upgraded and things were going to run smoother. And I said, uh, I said, why don't I have all the buses run 24 hours? He's like, that'd be something we'd like to look into in the future, but we don't get enough government funding. We need more funding. And I wanted to scream at him and say, look, you get funding when you're doing good. If, if the government gives me a little bit of money to start a business and my business is thriving, I can come back and show them the wins and the whys. I need more money. My business is doing good. I need more. I get more. But if they give me the same amount of money to start a business and I'm failing, I can go, yeah, I need more money. You didn't manage what we gave you correctly. I don't give you more of it. The, the palm tree people don't get that. Their, their minds don't work that way. Well, we need more money. Well, do better. Do good. 
do decent and you'll get more money. They're not even running the company decently. I would love to meet the guy who's running the company. Let, let me meet the president of Palm Train and sit down and have an interview with him on the Shady Sea Network. Everyone, if you agree with me even a little bit, look, I know I come off as a cocky asshole sometimes. I feel you. I get that. But do me a favor. Even if you don't finish this video, take it and share it on Twitter and tag Palm Tran. P-A-L-M-T-R-A-N. Even if you're not in Florida, even if you're not in the country, go on there and tag Palm Tran. Everyone, I want them to see this. Listen, Palm Tran, you have a good service. It's a public bus company. It's a good service. But you're running it incorrectly. You're running it. Let me run it. Let Shady C get one year as president of Palm Train. Let all my decisions stick. People will love it. We need to increase. We need to increase the stronger um, bus. The bus stops that have the more, most traffic. We need to get, put more buses on that route. Those routes. But anyways, that's not what this video is about. There will be in future. There'll be more of these. Trust me. Palm Train ain't fixing nothing anytime soon. So. There'll be more of these little rants. But anyways, if you agree with me, hit that like, subscribe, and share. If you don't, you can still hit the like, subscribe, and share. Post comments down below. What do you think of all this? What do you think of this foolishness with palm tree? And remember, this is Shady C, and I'm always right.